<laughs> now, on to more fun stuff. Let's get to know you better. Tell us some of your favorite sinful foods and where do we find you picking out on your cheat days? Where? 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 What, do, what are your favorite sinful foods and where do you pick out? I'll start first. Sure. I like Hokkien Mee. Like, the white one or the black one? The white one. Okay. Actually, the black one's really good too. Yeah, I basically, I like anything with the lard, you know. If they put the lard oh, in, you will taste them like. You will taste them nice. Okay. But yeah, so uh, for, for cheat days, you can find me at any uh, famous, I mean, not famous, at any uh, hawker center. Okay. Louis? Yeah, oh, for me, like, for me, whatever Chom Chom has, that's my thing. Like, sting, some of stingray, kang kong. Um, chicken wings, satay, all this kind of stuff. Right? Okay. Okay. Right, for me, I think every day is a cheat day. I don't wash <laughs> my diet. I, I eat whatever I crave. So sometimes I can be KFC. But I, I do have a especially sweet tooth and I really love desserts, cakes, and ice cream. Okay. Really? For me, I think it's confectionery. So I love baked goods. Um, song, a song, cookies, or cookies are uh, more than favorite. Especially the Starbucks cookies. Uh, Every time it's always every day or I think every day I eat two cookies of Starbucks. Other than that And uh, you still have twenty seven inch waist. Yes, isn't that amazing? Yeah, right. Bitch. <laughs> so what foods make you guys go yuck? What are your hated Broccoli. foods? Broccoli. Carrots. Fresh vegetables. All fresh vegetables, so no salad for you. Se- celery. Mm. Celery. Yeah, celery. I don't mind salads up if you put the dressing on top, but I think that defeats the purpose of eating salad. <laughs> <laughs> for me, I just started trying eating vegetables because previously I don't eat any form of vegetables, so I'm slowly trying. Okay, for me, I'm, for, I'm like the opposite. I love vegetables. I love celery, I just say. I love celery. What I hate most, uh, probably seafood. Uh, it's like, no more salt when you overdo it, it gets like, very chewy. And no matter how you chew and chew and chew, it just stays in the mouth. I can't bring it down. Okay. Yeah. Okay, tell us one sport or exercise that you're completely hopeless at doing. There has to be one sport you're hopeless at, right? Okay, for me, I started exercise, I'm quite good. I don't know what, what. I'm very bad at it that has got to do with balls. Ball sports. Okay. And I did curl polo once. When the ball was like the other end of the court, I was still at the other end of the other end of the court. So I don't know where the hell the ball was. Then my, my, I think my senior was like, Hey, Benny, come on, turn, turn, turn. Then by the time I was like, the ball, when I went to the other end of the court, the ball was the other end of the court. So, oh. yeah. Okay. Very bad at sports. For me, I think it's soccer, because I'm so used to having the ball in my hands and every time we play soccer I, I just have the tendency to use my hands all, all the while. Because of water polo. Yeah, because of water polo, basketball. Okay. I'm not very good in uh one sport because I'm kind of agophobic. I don't really like water. Like go to the beach right, I try not to like exceed like knee length. Yeah, so yeah. Depth. Yeah. Okay. Oh, for me it would be water polo. Cause like all the <laughs> yeah, like whatever happens below the water, I'm not very strong. Cause I'm not a very strong swimmer, so I think that's where I lack. Like. Okay, okay. Uh, tell us one health or fitness myth you used to believe in that now you realize is complete rubbish. Oh, oh. okay. I used to believe that like if you do like crunches, like the fat at your waist will disappear, but that we, I can debunk that right now because. Uh, by doing crunches, not only uh, that it will not help you lose fat, but fat will be lost all body wrong. It will not be specific to your waist. And at the same time, if you want abs that protrude out, you shouldn't do crunches. The, cor- the more suitable or appropriate exercise will be weighted crunches or those abs machines with weights to make your ass more long. Louis? I used to. When I started working out, I used to think that or my friends told me that you should go heavy and less reps to get more muscle growth. But however, it's actually um, higher reps with lesser weights and you hit hypertrophy and you get um, more muscle growth and you grow bigger that way. So when I first started, I wasn't really making much progress. Well, um, for me, I have not sure. I don't have any myth that I know that now are uh, completely rubbish. but. Maybe some of the things I believe in are actually completely rubbish, but I do not know of it yet. Okay. So, for example, I, I think bathing with cold water helps increase your metabolism, so I, I don't bathe with warm water. Okay. Uh, for me, I, I think I'm quite lucky. I, I'm being coached throughout my whole entire life so far. So, there's really nothing that I've done that's wrong. 
Okay. Uh, so you got everything right. Yeah, I, yeah. My, my codes are always right. <laughs> so the many follows the codes. Yeah. <laughs> Good principle.